Real Racing 3 is a mobile racing game developed by FireMonkey Studios and published by Electronic Arts. It was first released in 2013. The game is known for its high-quality graphics, realistic racing simulation, and extensive lineup of licensed cars and tracks. Real Racing 3 is acclaimed for its impressive graphics, providing detailed car models, realistic tracks, and dynamic weather conditions. The visuals contribute to a more immersive racing experience on mobile devices. The game features a wide range of licensed cars from various manufacturers, including Ferrari, Porsche, Lamborghini, Mercedes-Benz, and more. Each car is meticulously modeled to resemble its real-life counterpart, and players can upgrade and customize their vehicles. The time-shifted multiplayer technology in Real Racing 3 allows players to compete against their friends or other players, even if they are offline. The AI-controlled opponents in the race are based on the performance of real players. And it obviously has a career mode. Need for Speed No Limits is a free-to-play racing game developed by FireMonkey Studios and published by Electronic Arts, EA. The game was released in 2015 and focuses on illicit street racing in various urban settings. Players can customize and upgrade their cars with various parts and visual modifications. The game offers a variety of racing events and challenges, including time-limited special events and underground races. The game features a narrative-driven campaign where players participate in races and build their reputation in the underground racing scene. It has high-quality graphics and realistic sound effects, Players can compete against each other in real-time races, adding a competitive element to the gameplay. Asphalt 9 Legends is a popular racing video game developed by Gameloft Barcelona and published by Gameloft. It was released in 2018. Asphalt 9 includes a wide range of high-performance cars, realistic graphics and intense arcade-style racing gameplay. The game offers a single-player career mode, as well as various multiplayer modes where players can compete against each other in real-time races. The game features a touch-drive control scheme, allowing players to focus on the racing experience without the need for manual controls. I find this not to be a good feature. What's the point of the game if the car drives itself? It also includes a comprehensive car customization system, allowing players to upgrade and personalize their vehicles. Asphalt 8, Airborne, developed by Gameloft. It was initially released in 2013. The game is known for its fast-paced gameplay, high-quality graphics and a wide range of licensed cars. Asphalt 8 offers an arcade-style racing experience with high-speed races, stunts and intense action. The emphasis is on providing an adrenaline-pumping and accessible racing game. The game features a diverse lineup of over 220 high-performance cars from well-known manufacturers. These cars range from everyday vehicles to exotic supercars and concept cars. Asphalt 8 is praised for its impressive graphics and visual effects. The tracks are set in various locations around the world, and dynamic weather conditions contribute to the overall visual appeal. One of the distinctive features of Asphalt 8 is the ability for cars to perform mid-air stunts. Players can take ramps and perform flips, barrel rolls, and 360-degree jumps, adding a dynamic and acrobatic element to the races. Asphalt 8 includes a multiplayer mode where players can race against each other in real time. Multiplayer races support up to 8 players and offer a competitive and social aspect to the game. It also has a solid career mode. CarX Street is a racing video game developed by CarX Technologies for Mobile, known for its realistic driving physics and extensive customization options. Players can expect a street racing experience with a variety of cars, customizable features, and different tracks to race on. Unlike most of the other games mentioned, the game is fully open world, with good graphics and with a realistic environment. So you can just explore the vast world. The game also has realistic physics, and the controls are more realistic than most racing games. There are some issues with the frame rate, and you definitely need a pretty powerful device to play the game. Grid Autosport, a premium experience, but pretty worth it. The game includes more than 100 cars and 100 circuits, a solid career mode which includes touring, endurance, open wheel, tuner, and street. The game has realistic driving and great graphics like the rest. You get to pick a team, 
Each team with its own team target, sponsor objectives, and teammates who have their own attributes, which is pretty crazy for a mobile game, and then race in different events, acquiring points and glory. Each of the disciplines has very different cars and tracks, so there's plenty of variety to be found there. It has several difficulty levels, which lets you choose automatic or manual gears, various AI levels, a racing line, traction control and ABS, and even handling assist. Horizon Chase World Tour is a popular arcade-style racing game developed by Aquirus Game Studio. It was initially released in 2015. The game features a retro-inspired aesthetic with vibrant graphics and a soundtrack that pays homage to classic racing games. It offers a variety of tracks inspired by real-world locations, and players can race in different countries with changing weather conditions. The game also includes a World Tour mode, where players can compete in multiple cups across various continents. It gained positive reviews for its simple yet addictive gameplay, nostalgic elements, and its focus on fun and accessibility. A throwback to arcade racers like OutRun, and especially Top Gear, it delivers fast racing, tight controls, beautiful graphics, and a killer soundtrack.